Hey, hi, I'm Mona the Chicha. I am so sweaty right now. It's like 83 degrees right now. It's 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 I'm only sweaty and crazy like that right now because oh my gosh. I you know what? I am out of shape. Yes, I do a lot of walking, but it's flat surface. You know what I mean? That's kind of easy. My body get kind of used to that. <clears throat> But this time I decided, you know what, let's go that way because it's the mountain, right? Because we're like, I mean, it's, I'm not sure how far up it is, but we started walking up that way. And after probably like a hundred feet, I was tired because <laughs> it's like rock and, and there's no trail and it's bumpy and I don't know if that's what hiking is. You know, I figure hiking is climbing over rocks. It didn't, it doesn't look like that. I don't know. I don't know what's the difference between hiking and trails. I don't know what's the difference. I usually walk flat trails or trails that go up, you know, but they're flat, right? There's no rocks to climb over and all that. Man, yeah, like a hundred feet. I had to sit down for a minute. <laughs> And you know what? I didn't even check. Chica was so excited. Chica's really excited that we're here. Like she, when I sat down, she jumped on me and she was like, <laughs> and then she, she wants to put her paws on me, but then she went <laughs> and I was like, ah, oh, get down. <laughs> Cause she scratched me, you know, I, didn't, I guess it didn't leave a mark, but that's okay. So anyways, we went climbing up there, but I went real slow, you know, and I just kind of followed them wherever they were sniffing we kind of because there's like no trail there's no like there's no path nothing <laughs> so I just kind of followed them and as long as I could see the little diamond of my tarp thing then we're okay or if I see the road for the campsite then we're okay we're gonna get, get gonna get lost and then so we were messing around up there even though there's a bear out there somewhere but but I know it's not gonna come with the dogs with me um so we went down a ways and then I was like, I'm tired. I am tired of this. So we tried to go, we started to go down and I, we finally got on the, the, the campsite path, but I felt like it wasn't enough walking for them. I kind of felt bad for them. Yes, I was tired, but at least we're on flat road so I can rest now walking on a flat road. And so I thought, you know what, let's go across the street and see how far it is to the lake because the lake is like right down there. So, um, you know, we cross the street because it's a, it's a highway. So like we got to stop, make sure no cars are racing by cause like 50 miles an hour road, you know, no cars, were, we went across and then I, and then from there I saw, Oh, the lake is right there. The path was kind of iffy, but it was, it was fine. You know, so we ended up going to the lake. The lake is nice. And I could see across from the lake. There's not a campground over there, but there were people camped over there. But that's part of the wilderness part. Like they probably have four by four and we're able to get over there because it's on the other side of the lake. It's not, you know, um, that's a choice spot what they have because they're all by themselves. There's no other. I love that. I love to be by myself with no one around and I can just do whatever the heck I want. Like, you know, I'm going to take a shower right here, but all the neighbors are gone already. See, like I said, it's like they come for two days, one day and they leave. And so, but when I got here, all the sites were full and this was the only one that was available. But I figured out this one is perfect for me because all the other sites, how they're set up, like I wouldn't be able to put my tarp up like this. I was able to manage to figure out how to put the tarp up and it still be up and not like kind of at an angle like some places, you know, but um, yeah, people are going to start rolling, but they can't see me if I shower right there. So it's all good. As long as I just keep it silent, you know, <laughs> anyways, um, so yeah, I went to the water, they went swimming. I guess today it's going to be very hot and um, I have to shower because we're going into town. I don't want to go into town all funky like this. Um, I mean, not like I'm wearing the, the fanciest of clothing, but at least I'm clean, you know what I mean? And so <clears throat> I'm going to do that. And then I seen a lady, man. She can't find her keys. I feel so bad for her. 
I always put my keys in the same place every time. I never move my keys. Once I, I unlock the, because I have two sets, one for the camper and one for the car. It's a bundle of keys, though. It's not like one key, you know? So right when I'm done parking the car, it go, the, the, those keys go straight to the same hook I put it to all the time, and it stays there. And if I need to lock up the camper and walk away and, or leave the car or whatever, I have another set that's just for the camper doors. So I don't, you know what I mean? And they both have hooks on them so I can attach them to myself. You know, so, yeah. I hear her walking by, I think, looking. I've been praying in here that she finds those keys. Because that's one of my scares, you know. But I'm always careful. I know, like, everything in here, if I need something, I know exactly where it's at. Because I don't have a bunch of junk and things piled over. Like, I, don't, I know where things are exactly. And I'm constantly cleaning. And even if I want to reposition something, it's usually, like, the foodstuffs or whatever. You know, I have certain things that go in certain buckets or boxes or whatever. In there, it's like, mm, I still have some things I want to get rid of in there, some art, oh, some arts and crafts stuff that I don't really, I don't really need it. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling tired right now. I just finished, almost finished a whole cup of water, ice water. But we're going to go into town. I'm going to grab uh, some money for the next uh, five days. I like this right here. I like this, you know, it smells so piney, you know what I mean? It smells really good. It costs uh, more than um, the last place I paid was um, I think it was Cochiti Lake and I think that was $11 and that's where we didn't have shade and that's where it, when it got really super duper hot and before that it was um, Conchus Lake. That was that was the best. That was only eight bucks a night too, and uh, that water was clear water. Jump right in, you know. This right here is kind of murky, but the dogs liked it all right. And I saw a little kayaker out there, and I'm like, you know what? If it gets too too hot, I'm gonna get in there too. I have the the river shoes, even though I don't like to go in the water like that. But in this heat, and I see people out there already, I'm okay to go in there. Plus I have plus I have my jugs here that I can fill up with water and I can you know shower off when I'm done and clean up when I'm done. So that's another good thing up here. Here it's thirteen dollars. Normal price is twenty six. I have an, an an access pass, so it allows me half price. This is how I'm able to go to all these places because you know I have a card that allows half price. You know, well certain places like state parks, no. And, but, but federal stuff, yes, you know, uh, and then free stuff is just free stuff. Like, uh, Ojo Redondo, that was free. That was like free camping. And, but you got to haul up all your stuff. The road is rough. All the free stuff, the roads are rough. They don't maintain them very well. It's kind of like if you're lucky, if you get up there, you know what I'm saying? Uh, places that you pay, at least the roads are decent and there's bathrooms and there's water and some places have electric. So why not? You know what I mean? Free is nice. Yes, free is nice. But like I said, the roads are rough and it ca it can cause damage to your vehicle. And in the long run, you're going to pay the difference in the repairs of your vehicle. So, you know what I mean? Anyways, anyways, enough of that. So, uh, yeah, it's all good right now. It's, it's going to get hotter supposedly, but, um, like I said, I'm going to, I set up my shower in a new way. Every time I like get to a new spot, I, I can figure out new ways to set up the shower. I think this is it right here, <laughs> how I have it. It's hanging off a broom, <laughs> but it looks okay. So, you know, but that's all I have. Um, it's nice here. Oh, and the reason why I'm making another one so quickly is because, uh, when we went on the walk and came back, the previous video was uploaded, it took an hour, so I guess I can upload short videos. So, anyways, uh, I'm gonna give the the readings a try too, but just short readings, short, short, short ones, you know. But that's all I have. I'm Mona. This is Chit Chat, and I'll talk to you guys next time. <laughs>